Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. It's August the 11th, 2018. James Gunn is back in the news, folks. New photos surface of James Gunn at To Catch a Predator themed party. This article has these photographs, folks, and this is absolutely bizarre. New photos have surfaced of Guardians of the Galaxy director James Gunn attending what appears to be a pedophilia-themed costume party. The first to uncover the photos appear to be the Daily Caller's Ian Miles Chong. Folks, To Catch a Predator, I'm sure everybody knows what To Catch a Predator was a TV show with the host Chris Hansen and they would create online profiles of underage children and uh, catch adults attempting to meet up and get with these underage what they believed were underage children now James Gunn, as you can see in these photographs here, dressed up as uh, in a priest outfit and got women here dressed up, playing with baby dolls, eating, drinking a juice box here, appearing to simulate uh, to catch a predator. And here's a clown choking a girl here, a girl sucking her thumb, and the bunny rabbit theme. Folks, this stuff about James Gunn, director of Guardians of the Galaxy, was all over the news, the internet, and when he got fired for these tweets he made, the entire cast, all of these people came together in his support. Gunn was fired by Disney after a number of sickening tweets surfaced involving child rape, pedophilia, and molestation. Unbelievable, folks. One of the tweets involved Houston Huddleston, who recently pled guilty to possession of child pornography and now has to register as a sex offender. Huddleston was previously charged with soliciting a minor to appear in child pornography as well. Recent reports indicate that Disney was actually planning on bringing James Gunn back into the fold. This report comes after the entire Guardians of the Galaxy cast signed an open letter in support of James Gunn along with the letter of support Chris Pratt, who plays Star-Lord, called for James Gunn to return to the director's chair. Ian Miles Chong has got a, some tweets here from August the 10th, 2018, 1107 p.m. Uh, and this article here the, is from Breitbart. The now disgraced gun was fired by Walt Disney Company last month after countless jokes about child rape were dug up on his Twitter account. The jokes were more than five years old and also mocked sensitive subjects such as AIDS, the Holocaust, Mexicans, and I'm not even going to say that. Folks, I tell you what, these Hollywood people in this that what in the world is going on in these people's minds to think that this stuff they tweet, these jokes they make is appropriate, that it's all, all this is just normal to them. This is acceptable. They don't think anything at all uh, is wrong with this stuff here. Folks, you know, growing up, you know, there's that you're taught there's things that you don't you you don't joke about you don't say you don't joke about raping children 
you don't laugh and make fun of people in wheelchairs, but these people are not normal people, obviously, folks. I mean, this is just absurd. Let me know what you think in the comments below about James Gunn and his attending to catch a predator themed parties. Madness, folks. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.